Okay, so for today's video, let me just. Okay, so I'm doing what I spend in a week. And before you watch this video, I want you guys to like comment down below what you think I spend in a week. I think it'll be pretty interesting to like see what you think I would spend in a week versus at the very end when I tell you guys what I spend in a week. So yeah, comment down below before watching this video. You should do that and it's kind of interesting to see like what you guys think versus what I actually spent in a week. I don't know if you guys can tell, but my hair is different right now. It's kind of like a grayish cool tone color and before it was kind of yellow. This is the purple shampoo that I've been using. It's called Bold Unique and this is what it looks like. It's really purple, like it's really dark. I'm gonna insert some footage of me putting it in my hand. It's very purple. So yeah, on the box it shows like it removes brassiness and it turns your like yellowish blonde hair into like a cool tone color. So if that's what you're going for, this is a really good product. And yeah, it's a pretty big bottle, honestly. So, and this is just the shampoo, so you really don't need a lot. Just like let it stay in for like two minutes and then over time you'll see like, it's like kind of cool tone, some purple in it. So I'm gonna start off with Monday. On Monday, I went to Chick-fil-A and I spent $6. While I'm at college, I have a little break, like an hour and a half, and there's a Chick-fil-A right by my college. So the next thing I spent money on was hair stuff, and this was $2.37 at Sally's Beauty. I went to the dollar store that day because I was really hungry and I was gonna go somewhere. So I just stopped there for some snacks and it ended up being $11 because I also got like some gummies, like these are vitamin gummies. I got these little night gummies for sleeping. I got like these little snacks. I got a drink. So I kind of ended up getting a lot of snacks, but it wasn't just for like one time. It wasn't just to eat there. So moving on to Tuesday. We buy on Tuesday. Ooh, okay. So Tuesday, I spent a lot on gas. I went and got gas and that was $35.35. That's really cool. My gas is pretty expensive, but I'm pretty sure that was like a full tank of gas. So it wasn't bad. Gas is like really cheap here. It's like $2.50. So yeah. The next thing, I spent a lot on Tuesday actually. The next thing I spent money on, I made a college payment of $100 towards my tuition. My tuition's way more than that, but I just like make payments. I feel like that's pretty normal of what I spend in a week. Like this isn't just a one-time thing. I pay for college all the time. The next day, me and my sisters signed up to go to the gym and the first month is $50, but after that it's $10. So yeah, I spent $50 that day, but that's for like a whole month. So I wouldn't say that's what I spend in a week. So that's like $12 a week, but I'm just gonna put $50 for the total of this video because that is what I spent this week. So I also spent $3 at Target. I just went and got some wheat bread because we didn't have any in my house and I don't like white bread it grosses me out. So yeah, I spent $3 at Target and that was all I spent that day. So I think this is Thursday or Friday. It's the next day. I had an order on Fabletics and I spent $58 online, but I got three pairs of leggings and one of those little fuzzy jackets. So that's like four things for $50 or $58, so I'll just say 60. And then I also went to Chick-fil-A with my sister. We just got fries, so it only ended up being $2.50 for large fries. So I was proud of myself for not buying all this food. And yeah, my sister just wanted to go out because she had a long day of work. So we were just like, let's just go to Chick-fil-A. So yeah, that is what I spent money on. Okay, so the next day I... What did I spend money on? I went to Marshall's to get a protein blender bottle thingy that you make protein shakes in. I got a blender bottle and I got a pair of magnetic eyelashes, which ended up not working. So that's kind of annoying, but altogether, both of those were $10. And then I also went and got protein powder. This is honestly like a really good protein powder. It's like mixed with a whole bunch of like green vegetables and stuff and it lasts for like a month. So yeah, I spent $10 on protein powder, but honestly, it's gonna be really good for like going to the gym and stuff like that. I'm kinda scared to like add all this up. I feel like I spend a lot of money. 
Okay, so I'm gonna add in Saturday and Sunday because I feel like that counts as the week. So on Saturday, I went to Piccolo with my friends and it's just a coffee shop. It's really cute and we do homework there. So I was just editing videos and doing homework. Why do I keep moving my hands? Okay, so I got a drink there and that was $3.31. I just got iced coffee and I don't really think that's expensive compared to like Starbucks where you would pay like $5 for a drink. So that is what I spent money on on Saturday. And the next thing I spent money on Saturday was I spent... $65 for this club at my college. It's called PTK and I just joined that. So yeah, I just joined that club and I think it still goes to spring. And I think once you pay the $65, you don't have to pay that anymore. So yeah, that's what I spent my money on, $65 on that. So yeah, that is everything for Saturday. And what did I spend on Sunday? Okay, so Sunday was just a filming day, so I didn't really go out and spend money, but I did buy one thing. I got a drink at Starbucks, and I got a small one. It was just a nice coffee, so it was only like $2.63 because I used some of my stars, and that took off like 50 cents. So yeah, that's all I got. I only spent $2 that day. That was like the day that I spent the least amount of money, so I'm pretty proud of myself for that. Maybe I just like shouldn't leave the house. So now I'm going to total up how much I spent. And I'm kind of nervous because I kind of spent a lot. So I wrote all the numbers on this little notebook so I can just use the calculator and add it all up. Okay, so six plus, wait, I should be screen recording this. Okay, so adding up Monday, the Chick-fil-A, the Sally's and the dollar store was 1937. And then the next day, gas plus the college payment. Okay, so yes, yeah, so far for Monday and Tuesday, it's 154 for two days out of the week. That's not good. So yeah, okay, so adding up Fabletics plus, what did I spend 250 on, did I say? What did I spend 250? Oh, Chick-fil-A plus $50 at the gym plus $3. What's the $3? Target bread. Plus $10 at Marshalls, plus $10 on protein powder, plus $3.32 on a drink at Piccolo, plus the $65 to join that club. I have my total right now, and before I show you guys my total, you guys should comment down below what you think I spent this week before watching the whole video because I think it'd be really interesting. And then the last thing was Starbucks, and that was $2.63. Oh, okay. Okay, so the total amount of money that I spend in a week living at home, not having to pay for rent, going to community college, living in New Jersey is $359.17. So yeah, that is what I spend in a week, $360. I make more than that in a... No, I don't make more than that in a week. Yeah, I definitely don't think I make $360 a week. Okay, so yeah, I realized that I have a shopping addiction and that needs to stop, but it was also, it was Black Friday this week. I had to pay for college and I was with friends because it was Thanksgiving break, so I went out with my friends and like got food. So yeah, I wouldn't say this is like an every week kind of thing. So yeah, that is just what I spent in a week. If you guys like that video, make sure to give me a huge thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys in my next video.